Hi guys and welcome back to another Final Fantasy 7 Remake video. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can pick up the Chocobo and Moogle Summon because it is an item that you can completely miss and I'm not too sure if the area that it's in is actually accessible after the storyline but even if it was I can imagine that the material won't be powerful enough to use so if that does interest you and you don't want to take the chance of missing it then I'll show you how you can pick it up and if you do enjoy today's Final Fantasy 7 Remake guide don't forget to hit that like button subscribe for more Final Fantasy 7 Remake content and with that being said let's mosey so first, at the beginning of chapter 6, titled Light the Way, you're going to come to this area here. Now, it's going to be split up into three sections, and they are F, G, and H. And basically, you start on F, and you've got to make your way over to H. Now, when you do finally get over to the H platform, you do have an interaction with the actual summon. Tifa notes it sitting behind a fan, but the team quickly move on and you kind of do get sidetracked into doing other things, which I'll leave out to the video, but just in case you do, as long as you're in this area, you've still got a chance of picking it up. Now, basically, when you get to the end of this area, you've got to switch off three lights to power up this particular platform for you then to take it up to the next stage in the mission. Again, I won't show that now, but I'm just using that as point of reference so you know you're in the right place. And basically, you want to take this platform over here to the control room where could they be going embarking on an adventure to find some treasure and you need to go up the ladder and upon doing so you will notice this console and upon pressing it the door to the right will open and you'll get a time limit on the screen and basically you need to defeat the queen grass strike and the two sentry rays within that time slot and when you do there's another control panel on the other side of the room you need to interact with as you can see i just cut it fine but i do get it done and then you can walk through the door turn right and the summon is underneath the fan now, as I say, there is a slight chance you could miss this if you didn't go for a full exploration gameplay, which I do. So if the video did help you out, guys, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe for more Final Fantasy VII Remake hints, tips and tricks. And until next time, take care.